You could walk, you know. You're, you're lazy, sir. You're lazy. Why why you ain't walk down the road, huh? It's right down the road. Have the you street. seen how fat I am, sir? What's going on guys? Welcome back to another DVRP video. Thank you guys for all the love and all the support on these videos. I do appreciate it. In today's video, we're gonna be using a taxi cab and I'm gonna be using my Caribbean character. So this guy, he's gonna be a Caribbean uncle. I want to start making my characters more of a storyline kind of basis. So that's why I'm going to be doing this. So this is going to be my Caribbean character. My character is going to have a Caribbean accent. I don't know which one I'm going to use yet. Or maybe I'll switch in between. But I'm going to use this one as a Caribbean character. I'm going to make him drive a taxi cab. Okay. And we're going to see if we can get some fears. We're going to see if we can get some stuff going. And uh, hope you guys enjoy. Hit that like button, subscribe, and give you guys a chance to go ahead and hit that like button right now. Go ahead and do that right now, y'all. Hit that like button. It helps me out a lot. It helps me on the channel. It helps me push me out in the algorithm so you guys can continue to see me doing some of this RP in um, my, on my channel, on YouTube, etc. So let me know if you like this or not. Drop a comment down below. Let me know what you thought about the video. Let me know what you think I can improve. Let me know what you want me to do next as another video. Okay? So, thank you guys for all the love and all the support. Again, I'll see you guys next time. Enjoy the video and uh, let's go. All right, we put in an advert um, for us to go ahead and hopefully get a fear. So, we got a, we can be a taxi cab driver for right now. Um, I don't know. I'm pretty sure this has like police lights. That's why this thing comes on. But I really hope that it doesn't do that. Uh, that's probably it, right? I don't know. But. Wagwan, my brother. How you doing, man? I'm going to try to speak in my in my Beijing accent. But my Beijing accent isn't very strong. Um, because, you know, I, I, I interact a lot with Americans. And it takes a lot of code switching and stuff like that. Because I don't, if I talk in my normal tongue um, in Barbados, um, half of these guys are not going to understand a thing. Thing I'm saying, bro. That's for sure. So, oh, this taxi is pretty quick, bro. Not gonna lie. Okay, that's a cop up there. He probably caught me going pretty fast. Not gonna lie. Eh, it looks like something happened on the bank. I don't know what's going on there. It's crazy. See if I can get anybody to get a taxi out. Let's see here. All right, we let's go this way. All right, there's a helicopter up as well. Hopefully they don't they don't completely ignore me. Somebody abandoned a car over there. I thought that cop would have caught me, but I guess he didn't. All right. Let's see, let's see when, or right, if I can get a fear. Fear back. Hello? Hello, sir. Uh, are, is the taxi still available? The taxi is very much available. All right. Um, would you be able to pick me up at Vespucci Boulevard 752 by the fleece bank? Yes, sir. I can do that. All right. Thank you, sir. You said 752? 752 Vespucci Boulevard. I'll be there in a jiffy. All right, thank you, sir. All right, that's our first call right there. Uh, I accidentally pressed the wrong button, so can you stop trying to stream? Okay, that's weird. Anyways, he says seven five two. Seven f All right, as long as that cop doesn't be weird. We gonna run this light. Don't think that's any of them. Why go on my brother? You call for a taxi?
What go on, my brother? Anybody call for a taxi? Hello? Connection lost. Are you serious? For some reason, I lost connection somehow. Wait, hold on. What's going on? Hello? What's up? One second, sir. Sorry. What go on, my brother? Anybody call for a taxi? Yeah, me. Uh, I'll be there in a sec. I'll be there in a second, sir. Okay. Hello? Mm. You gotta hold on a second. We have this guy detained. Yeah, Sheila, what? Wait, 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 I want. Why you want? I tell you, put all this food in the fridge, man. Why you put it? Why you put all the food in there? Where you put the food in the fridge? Huh? Man, I love cab drivers. Why? Why you <laughs> yeah. put the food in the fridge? I told you, put the food in the fridge. You gotta wrap it up in that clear wrap, and you gotta put it down in the fridge, man. What? What you told me? Come on, man. We gotta be. I I did all that aku, aki and flying fish for you guys to go ahead and and and, and let it spoil. I put it down in the pantry. Ah, huh? where your sister is? Where your sister? Call your sister to the phone, man. It's um, really it's Dakota. Dakota has. Alright, Dakota's. Uh, he's just. Are you okay? Lashima, Lashima, oh. why ain't like your brother put the food in the fridge? Huh? The thing is, vehicles. Tell your brother to put your food in the fridge. All right, what's the uh, story? Oh. Uh, well, well, wrap up the food in some clear rape and put the fat, well, put the thing yeah, in the fridge. Foot, um, he what do you do with a banana bread? The banana um, bread still there? So his, uh, his mm. alibi checks out. Oh, Get the banana, banana bread. bread in the fridge. Alright, that's cool. Thank you very much. Hold on, I got a bunch yeah. of police on my vehicle. Y'all got, my, Sir, you got you, anything um, for me? Right, your alibi you. checks out. So what are you doing? I'm waiting on my fare. Yeah, he's all good. Don't worry. Uh huh. Alright, right, bye bye. bye, -bye. So, where you want to go, so? Yeah, uh, um, give me one second to look at my map. I'll mark it on the map. It's, I'll, it's I'll registered it in the old the system. The old system. We haven't updated to the new system yet. Mr. O'Connell. Totally. I'll still pull you over if it's unregistered, though. Why are you being such a such a unwanted person? Thank you. Here's your, here's your ID back. You enjoy yeah. the rest of your day. Apologies Keep for your man. inconvenience. Alright. All right, tell me where you're going there, so man. I put it in the GPS for you, sir. Okay, that would be f that would be twenty-seven dollar. Oh well, that's cheap. All right. <laughs> Just did an illegal U-turn <laughs> right in front of the police, bro. Ah, what go on, brother? Brother, what you doing today? Nothing much. You know, you ever try some aki and flying fish? I have not. I've tried banana bread. I heard you said something about banana bread. Yeah, banana bread be nice, nice, nice. You gotta, you yeah. gotta try black pudding. Black pudding. Yeah, black pudding. It's made with blood. What? It's made with cow blood and pink pig blood. Ah, uh, why you coming around the road, so man? We're all with you. Yeah, you gotta try sauce and pudding. It's black pudding. Oh, hold on to your seat. Jesus, get some air. Man, I, I think I'll tip you extra. This is the fastest taxi ride I've ever had. Now, we cabin people, we don't make no sport, huh? Yeah. We go and go and go. We got to get that money, you know? Yep. Just hold on. Hold on. <laughs> I'm just yelling at this point. <laughs> Come on! All of the, the road! Up, someone went in and stole all the coffee grounds. Oh, that sucked. Oh, all y'all in the road, man. Get out the way. Wrong with you, man. All right, thank you, sir. All right, you're at your destination, eh? Nice yep, and safely. There you go. Very safely, sir. Thank you. Thank have you. A have one. a good day, sir.
All right, let's go back. <laughs> Successful fear. I don't know. I got to get my asset down, bro. My asset is not down properly. Oh, shoot. Come on, where the police at now? Nah? I'ma just tell I'ma just tell the police here. Hey sir. Hey, what you want, man? I got What's a question. up? How you doing? What's the uh you got the name of the last guy that you just dropped off? Nope, he just gave me twenty seven dollar and a tip. Alright, well I appreciate it, man. You stay safe. You too, sir. You, where did you drop him off at exactly? It's a house up there at 499. Alright, I appreciate it, man. That ain't Thank none of my business. You go handle your business. Alright, have a good day. <laughs> the police are coming, so we'll see what they do here. I'm going to try to stop them. I'm going to be like, hello, Mr. Officer, sir. I just heard some gunfire up in there and those big houses up there, huh? I think somebody's getting getting this they're, they're getting robbed. Hey police! Hello! 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 Hey Mr. Officer oh, sir! What's up? I heard some gunfire coming up at those big big houses up there, man. I don't know, somebody might be getting robbed or hurt or something like that. Alright, did you see anything? No, nah, I just heard like four or five shots. It held for pop, 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 pop. That's all I heard. Okay. I just called the police just in case somebody got hurt or something. You know, those white people up there be rich in the hell. You know, they got a lot of stuff up there. People might try to steal them. You know what right, I mean? Right. You heard it all? No, nah, I'm good. I'm good. I just heard the, the gunfire pulled over here and I called the police. Alright, were they automatic, semi-automatic pistol shots? Yeah, I, I think it was pistol. I heard pop, 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 pop. Bit in my, back, back in my country, you know. They got the SMG. How to brrrr, you know? All right. But here I heard pop, pop, pop. Alright, you're not hurt at all? No, I'm good. Alright. I'ma just go and let y'all handle your business. Alright, sir. Thank you for the report. Alright, just gave him information there. Alright, he's good now. Let the police do their job. Bro, I might need to get a gun or something because I just snitched on somebody. <laughs> That's crazy. Bro, Caribbean people people don't usually snitch, but you got those some uh, a couple of neighbors who will call police on you. So I just figured I would uh, just do that real quick, you know, just to make the RP fun and imaginative. So hopefully you guys enjoy that so far. We're going to wait until our next uh, kind of fear or see what, what anybody else is doing. See if we can get anybody else to order a taxi. Hopefully, I don't get stopped for the police from doing my driving. But, you know, I am driving kind of mad right now. And we jump in it. Oh, that's Crown Vit suspension right there. Crazy. Well, go on. What do you want, man? Get on my face. All right. I'm just trying to practice my ass in a little bit, bro. Like, to be fair for a Caribbean person, I don't, I don't think I have an accent. I think I sound more like, like, I don't, I don't sound like my native Caribbean Barbadian accent. I mean, sometimes it comes out, but the majority of the time, I don't speak in my my native tongue. And I think, I think that's something that happens a lot for people, especially over the internet, when they're like interacting with people from other countries. Um, I've definitely grown out of the the thick Caribbean accent that I had because when I first started, I had a thick Caribbean accent, bro. It was it was so it was mad thick, but you know, we'll see. Um, first I gotta register this car because they said it's not registered, so let's register the car real quick. Um, let's do what? What's today? The eighteenth. Okay, let's do that approved vehicle type is a sedan plate is going to be all right so 420 420 blizzard and then and not that i not that i i like that kind of stuff bro I, I don't do that but yeah i'm just saying you know it's just a meme 
Um, Ford Crown Victoria. Let's make sure we get a gun though, just in case, because people be kind of trolling right now. Let's see, that's uh, probably a 2011 uh, company vehicle. Downtown taxi cab. Insurance provider, we use Moore's. There we go. Let's grab a gun real quick. Just in case. And I think we have some new guns. Actually, we got some new guns in here. I haven't checked these out yet. So let's check these out real quick. Oh, this is cool. This is like flashlight or something like that. Um, what was it again? Benelli. Barrels. Let's try this one. Oh, this is cool. That's quite large. All right, ammo capacity. Twenty-four rounds. Okay. The mag. Can put a scope on it as well. Crazy. So how do these look when you go into first person? Let's see this. Oh shoot! That's fire. That's quite fire. All right, let's try. That's the Benelli um, pressers. Shotgun with a suppressor, crazy, crazy, right? And then stock, field stock or tactical stock. Okay, that's all. Yep, that's all. Let's despawn that. Go to. Ooh, Air Fifteen. Mag. Flashlight. It already comes with everything on. Interesting. Despawn that. Ooh. All right. Does it replace uh some of these guns though? So let's go to player weapon. Uh. Wait. This is still in here. I don't know why. Thought I took that out. The pump shotgun is still that. Thought rifles. Ooh, now we got a new AR for this. Okay. So now nobody can complain about the ARs we have. Because now we got we got some nice and cool for the law enforcement to have. Let's go in here. Let's see how these work. Okay, that's pretty cool. All right, we got an MK18 now. All right, player the weapon option is carbon rifle. Let's unequip that. This is still this one. Okay, we got to find something for that. All right, we got to find something to replace those other weapons. All right, is there anything else in here that I just that I added that I haven't seen yet? Yeah, there's something else. There's supposed to be another gun, but I don't know where it is. So we'll see. Maybe it's in the SMG section. Nope. Nope. MG. Nope. 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 All right. It's not in the SMG section. All right. Let's go back outside. See if there's anybody else that is going to use a taxi. Or are they going to keep ignoring me? I tell you, man. You don't put no hair in nobody food. All right, let's see if we can we can pull this off here. Let's grab our taxi. And we're going to just leave. Wagwan. How are you, sir? How you doing today? I'm doing good. You That's want a taxi? Right. Hell yeah, I want a taxi. Alright, uh, where you at? I'm at 738, sir. Let's 
So seven three. Seven three eight. I'll be there in a the jiffy. Seven three eight Vespucci Boulevard, sir. I'm on my way. I'm at the bus stop that's on the side of the road, sir. Oh, I see you already. Woo! Yeah, I'm fast. Speedy. You said you're at a bus stop? Yeah, I'm at the bus stop, man. Alright, I'll be there. Just waiting for the police to leave. Oh, why are you gonna miss you with the police, sir? Don't worry about it. Mind your business. That's true, alright. Oh, hey, man. Oh, you almost hit me there. Nah, I got it under control. Hop in, man. Where you wanna go? Oh, uh, let me just get in the back real quick. All right, can I go to the bean machine? I have, I heard they have some stellar coffee up there. You could walk, you know, you're, you're lazy, sir. You're lazy. Why, why you ain't walk down the road, huh? It's right down the road. Have the you street. seen how fat I am, sir? I mean, you are pretty fat. You got a big belly upon you. Yeah. You got a big belly pun now. I, I tell you, I tell you, I put two Rob Weiler behind you and let you run off that fat, eh? <laughs> Can you speak English, sir? I am speaking English, sir. You want me to speak a little patois for you? No, sir. Okay, just making sure, right? So watch your All mouth. Right. I'm speaking English. You can't understand me, sir. No, sir. Hey, can I go to the bean machine? It's right up here. It's a green light, dummy. What'd you call me? I ain't no, I ain't no dummy. Hey! How much? How much? Yeah, How you much? better give me my money. How much? What y'all want there, boy? What, what, what wrong with you? How much? That's gonna be fifty dollar. How much? It's gonna be fifty dollar. How much? That's gonna be fifty dollar. Oh my god. That gonna be fifty dollar. Give me my fifty dollar. Give me my. That's gonna be fifty dollar. This is fifty dollars. Fifty dollar. Fifty dollar. Maybe you should have walked, you little fatty. Give me my fifty dollar. This guy's the guy from the Thank you. What now? Is he a felon? Hello, sir. No, don't you don't drive off. Why you want there, officer? What 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 you want, sir? You're pulling me over? For yes, what? Sir. What'd I do? I'm gonna, I was gonna get to that. Did I come here to I'm some deputy motherfucking with the Los Santos County coffee? Sheriff's Office. The reason for the stop is you got an unregistered get vehicle. Back in that My vehicle's no, not unregistered, sir. sir. Yes, you so gotta, you gotta right. check your stuff again, huh? What did you say? No, it's coming back no check your stuff again, huh? Go I'm telling you, it's, not, it's registered, oh, sir. Oh, also, no. you're coming. You're matching the description of a no. Maybe call. you should check and make Keep sure off. the zero is not a no. You're also, Bitch. coming back is the description from a 911 call. A 911 call about what, huh? A 911 call, yeah. Can you stop vehicle? What? Can you stop at the vehicle so we for can what? Talk? Because I'm asking you to, sir. Why do I need to step out of the vehicle for a talk? Because I am asking you to. I don't want to feel. I don't want to get on my vehicle. I don't feel well, safe getting on my vehicle. You. Okay, well, I'm asking you to get a supervisor out here because this don't make no sense. <laughs> okay. I want your One supervisor. Give me your manager. Seven five two. Yeah, there he is. Trust five right here. All right, you can hang tight here. I don't understand. They they come up at me telling me nothing, man, nothing but nonsense. Eh? I'm gonna call my my girlfriend. Vehicles come in unregistered on my ALPR. He's also. Sir, go ahead and just tap the phone for me until we get this figured out, okay? Hey Sheila, you know I got I got stopped by the police, right? I'm gonna keep this on video call so you can see. Make sure they don't shoot me, huh? Yeah, I got stopped by the police. Company's probably registered to the company, not individually. That's why it's not coming up. All right. I don't know. The ALPR is saying unregistered, and uh, How you doing, it sir? does that when it's unregistered. Your ALPRs don't account for for zeros that are O's. Maybe that you need to check that out, sir. Sense. How you doing, sir? I'm doing pretty good. What's your name? My name's Captain Hines. I'm with the uh, local sheriff's department. How can I help you today? What's going on? I don't know why this cop here stopped me. 
He said my vehicle's unregistered. I told him why it seems like it's unregistered when it's actually not unregistered. He needs to go ahead and check that out. But he didn't want to check that out. And then he wanted to ask me to get on my vehicle for no reason. I don't know why I need to get on my vehicle just for a talk. Why can't you talk to me when I'm in my car? And by the way, I got my video recording right here to make sure y'all y'all under weird. Okay, you know, no problem. I understand that. That's completely up to you, right? All and right why so why do y'all need four cops up here on me? I ain't like I, I'm a shooter or something. It's in Jamaica. I understand that. I understand that. Okay, so what happened today is we recently got an hour one call for a robbery happening at the meat machine. Uh, we got a description from the uh, control center. They gave us a description of a uh, African American male with a yellow and red shirt. Uh, as well as uh, black shorts. Um, so the reason that the officer behind me stopped you uh, was due to the fact that your vehicle came up unregistered in our system. Now that could have been a mistake or a miscalibration with the uh, system within our cars. We will double check that. I'll double check that myself. And the reason that you wanted to, uh, you were requested out of the vehicle uh, is due to the fact that you do match the description of the subject at the, uh, the beam machine robbery. So we just wanted to get your ID, get all your information, see what happened and uh, see what was going on. Uh, we are going to check the CCTV, get all the footage, but for the time being, we do need you to step out just so we can get you detained uh, because you are a viable subject at this time. I didn't rob none, man. I understand they, that. They got, they, that clear. they got their stuff, even the cup. I didn't I didn't take none from the beam machine. I understand that. And if you have nothing to hide, we'll get you on your way. But as of right now, I do need you to step out so we can get you detained and we can figure everything out. Does that work? All right, but you aren't putting in me in no handcuffs. I ain't no criminal. I understand. We're just going to put you on the curb just so you can sit tight. All right, come with me. <laughs> Why are you coming out here? Come in, try and take my fears, man. The plate? What's wrong with you, man? This is what you lost your bonus, dummy. <laughs> hey, you better get, you better get out of here, man. He has a red light. You better get out of here. Get out of here if he has a red light. What's wrong with you, man? We're just going to go on the curb. You better mind your business, huh? I'm going to get I'm going to get my boy my boys on you. You better get out of here. Hey, Keep get going. Here. He has a red light. You can't Keep get it out going. Of Keep okay, it so going. Right. So if you wouldn't mind, if you wouldn't mind just leaning up against the wall, I don't want you getting your shorts ready. Right. You, you don't have to sit. You can just lean up over there. All right, Trooper. Can you check the CCTV if you haven't already from the uh, beam machine? Bruh. All right, sir. What's your name? Sounds crazy. My name Tashon. But you can call me Mr. Morgan. Mr. Morgan at your service. Mr. Morgan. Yeah. Alrighty, Mr. Morgan. So as of right now, I'm gonna have one of my troopers go and check out the uh, camera footage from the Beam Machine Coffee. Uh, if the could it? Yeah, sorry, I can't talk today. If the footage comes back uh, and it doesn't match your description, or we clearly see that it wasn't you, then we'll get you on your way, uh, and then we will verify your plate and all the information. Now I understand you work for the uh, downtown tax cab company. Oh, Is the vehicle gosh. registered to the business? Not so. the The insurance is on the business, but the vehicle is mine. The vehicle's personal. Okay. All yes. Right. So we're gonna check the plate, and uh, it should come back. If it doesn't, it's, then we'll get. We the we own we own the cars, but you know you kind of like you kind of license the right to use the down, down, downtown cab name, if if that makes sense. Yeah, I got you. So is the insurance information in your glove box in the vehicle? Yeah, that be in my glove box, right in the little okay. cubby hole right there. I got you. Would you mind if I went and grabbed that? Go ahead. All right, cool. You don't have anything in there I need to know about, right? Weapons, narcotics, anything like that? Alcohol? I ain't got nothing so, man. Okay, cool. Footage from being machine shows. And, uh, How you doing, sir? Can you check your sky? Yeah, whenever you're ready, ready, I got the plate for you. This, uh, All right. Uh, worker at the All right, what do you get off? Um, yeah. it is registered, yeah. it is, it's registered through the company with Moore's Mutual Insurance. Um, Tishon Morgan's gonna be the- I got it, man. I can't do more than one thing at a time, man. You gotta wait on me for me to top out all the uh, stuff, man. Why out. would you, man? Can't, can't you wait? Okay, cool. Damn. Me, I'm trying to get, I'm trying to get you the information you gotta get, man. Give me some time. Damn. The brain's, the brain's moving a little slow today, man. I'm old. Well, I'm not really that old, but, you know, I got to get some time to get Skybox ready. You don't look a day over 20, Mr. Morgan. Yeah, that's because I, I use Tish Hanley. You know that skincare routine? I take care of my face. I also go and get Volcano Mud and you put it on the face. You know, it, it opens up the pores. Volcano Mud? Yeah, you should go to Montserrat. It's a beautiful Caribbean island. 
you know grab that stuff or you can go to saint lucia take a dip in the in the uh in the sufir mountain and sufir volcano and you'll be fine man huh. well unfortunately my paycheck won't cover a trip like that but i'll see what i can do until then nah it's real real cheap man to, especially to americans real real cheap just go down you pay a little pay like 300 dollar go in there get your get your pores and everything good it's good for the spinal injuries and all the the, the muscle pain and aches you know we go in there all the time it's nice and healing therapeutic <laughs> I got you. Uh, once your brain stops lagging, if you wouldn't mind referring to the skybox for me. Yeah, I can't talk and type at the same time, man. I understand that. Um, uh, let me see. Mel and the curb code in disagreement with the work happening. Where the worker shows him and he throws the coffee in the worker's face leaves the cup does not pee and leaves the alright Alrighty, Trooper, do you have anything? Yep, he, uh, so it looks like they were outside on the curb, they had a disagreement, that's what it looks like. It was a worker shoved him, so he threw coffee in the worker's face. Can you turn your voice, uh, box up? What was the key to change it to whisper from whisper? Con. Uh, your F11 muscle. All right, there we're we just go. doing this. Okay, so look. Oh, this subject on the curb with the worker. This was a, little, a disagreement. Uh, one of the workers shoved him, and then he threw the coffee in the face of the worker, and then he didn't pay and left. Okay, can you go inside, talk to the worker, see if they want to press charges or just want to have him trespassed? Ten four. Do, do, All right, do, do, Mr. Morgan, do, do, do. so... I was. I came here. You know, I was understanding with you. I tried to get your side of the story. Is there any reason why you didn't tell me what happened inside? Why well, it wasn't that important. I didn't lie to you. I told you. I told you that I don't like what they said to me. I don't like what they did to me, and I just left. I didn't. I left the cup there. I left everything there. Right. They got the coffee inside. It doesn't matter that it's on that man's face. He didn't have to touch me. He shouldn't have touched me. The... I he shouldn't that, have touched you... me. I understand that. But Why am I going to pay for something that has here in it? It makes no sense. If you're an establishment running a business, you don't put here in it. If I if I come up to you and you and I ask to have another cup of coffee because you got your your dirty ass pubic here in my coffee, then we going to have a problem. And then he goes ahead and touches me. That's a breach of my rights right there. So I, I threw it in his completely. face and I ain't paying for that neither. My mama, my mama ain't raised me to be no little when, slouch. When did that happen? They're gonna want to press charges, and they don't want him here ever again. Sir. Okay. Well, let's get the. You gonna press, press charges, charges after? Well, I want to press charges on the worker for for touching me. That's assault. We will. Okay. We'll press. We'll have the uh, worker held accountable. Um, trooper, is it a is it a local worker inside or is it? A, it is a local. It is okay. All right, we'll have the uh, we'll have the worker held accountable. We'll make sure that he gets processed as well. But I need you to go ahead and turn around for me. Well, I thought it was. Ah, uh, whatever, man. All right. Listen, I try to be understanding with you, but you know it's just how things are gonna work today, okay? I don't understand why I'm going to jail for throwing coffee in somebody's face. It's basically self-defense. It's it's, an, it's assault. It's self-defense. Coffee in someone's face. It's self-defense. He hit me first. The unit here? He hit me first. Should not hit me. Okay. In uh, my country, how it works, if you hit somebody, you better be ready for the licks. All right, sir. So you're going to be placed under arrest for assault. All right. At this time, you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be held against you in the court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you cannot afford an attorney, will be appointed to you Bruh. by the citizen. They arrested me for that? That's crazy. Yeah, whatever. Okay. With these rights in mind, still speak to any state official law enforcement officer. What? At this time, do you still wish to speak to any state official or law enforcement officer for your question? 
No. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and pat you down. Is there anything on you? He's gonna poke or stick or stab me. I ain't got none, man. No. His wallet and the key. Hey, Sheila, tell tell them they're arresting me, man. Come bail me out. She's still on the phone. You gotta you gotta press out that call there, sir. All right, all the stuff is uh in the vehicle, and um, yeah. he's ready to go. Okay. So I might want to get ten fifty one for that cab. Yep. Bruh. I can't believe they're arresting me for that. That's crazy. I don't know about that. Alright. See those taxi cabs that keep that keep messing with me? We gonna we gonna do some crimes now. We gonna do some crimes now. Cause I don't I don't like them trying to take my business. You get what I'm saying? So guys, stay tuned for the next video. Thank you guys for all the love and all the support. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm gonna go to jail right now for whatever it is that I just did. So hopefully you guys enjoy. Um I'll see you guys next time. Have a great day, have a great week, and uh yeah, peace everybody.